Okay. A few shots just stopped falling kind of in that second half because you guys got back into it. We're down by five and yeah. um, we're a couple possessions away from getting back into it. Yeah, I felt, you know, we didn't start well. So a lot of times when you're playing catch up, it takes a lot of energy. And uh, it felt like when we did cut the lead, as you mentioned, you know, at a certain point we, we just ran out of gas. And, uh, you know, you want to dig down deep for, you know, a playoff game. But uh, hats off to Chicago. They played well. And uh, obviously not the result we wanted, but very appreciative of our, our guys and feel grateful to have an opportunity to coach them and, and be the coach of the Hawks. For not to get too far away from the game really quickly, but for you to kind of go through this full season with all of the ups and downs, what, what's your biggest takeaway from how this team competed, how they grew, and you know how they can continue growing yeah. moving forward? I, I think that well, that's what you want. You want you want to you know you want to grow and try to get better, and regardless of you know what you're handed, whether it's uh, you know the, the dealing with adversity and Embracing it on some level is, is, you know, what you want to do. And I thought our guys did that, you know, throughout the course of the year. So, um, like I said, I'm proud of them and their approach. And, um, you know, obviously let this settle in. And, and it feels like the, the Bulls kind of threw a lot at you guys, too, whether it was DeRozan, whether it was Kobe who goes off for how, how much yeah. he did. And, Sumo and Russo and all of the, the that starting five just they seem to kind of stretch you guys thin a little bit. What do yeah. you see from the defense? Well, Demar started really, you know, making shots and you're game planning to, you know, try to get the ball out of his hands if it's appropriate. Um, you know, we did a bunch of different things and you know eventually some of the Sumo and obviously Kobe White and pick and roll. Um, number of things that challenged us. Um, thought our offense hurt our defense at times. They were really good in transition when they made their runs. And that's a hard one to quote unquote game plan against. But, um, you know, like I said, anytime you commit two to the ball in whatever situation it puts you in positions where, you know, you have to close out and people are driving, driving you. And that, that was kind of a consistent theme. And, if you don't do that, you know you saw Kobe White getting into the lane, and uh, so a lot, a lot of things we can pick apart that that uh, we need to do better. Um, but bottom line is that uh, we had a group that competed, and uh, as you said, went through a lot together, and hopefully that'll make us better going forward. And as far as uh, you know, DeAndre's night not what you guys were hoping for, but what did you see from him that he tried to fight through to try to keep giving you guys something? Yeah, I mean, I, I thought, you know, we were worried about he stayed out of foul trouble. I thought he'd get a good job on DeMar. Um, you know, the shots he hit early um, were, were contested. They were tough shots, and he's capable of doing that. Um, you know, so, you know, we, we had a lot of guys. You, I know they, we wanted to play a little better collectively, and that's probably true of a lot of guys individually as well. Last one, I, I don't want to keep you too long, but I know one thing we were worried about was just Trey's conditioning, you know, coming back. This is his fourth game back from injury. Just it seemed like he, he still needed an adjustment period, or it, or did he seem like he had his legs under him tonight? I, you know, I, it's hard. I don't know. You know, they, you know, it was more of a collective thing, I think, that we reached a point where um, they put so much pressure on the rim, and you know we had to respond offensively, and we did for a while there. And then, um, you know, if you if you struggle to store, if you're not getting stops, we made some plays, and um, a few times, like you said, had opportunities that we didn't convert, and that uh, that's essential, you know, to score on the other end when we're you know undersized a little bit and and uh, playing against a team that, that shot the ball. I don't know what they were from three. Um, but it felt like they, they made open looks when we when we were uh, in rotations and things. And as I said, I think the biggest thing was, you know, driving the ball. They were on the rim a lot. Okay. All right.